Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be me showing you the um, All Is Magic, wait, All I See Is Magic palette by ColourPop. And here it is. The eye look that I have today is was created using just this palette. So I really love this palette after using it. The shadows are top notch and you get a little bit of everything. You get mattes, you get shimmers, you get metallics and some like dual chrome ones it's so it's such a good palette i enjoyed using each and every one of them the mattes by far blew me away because they're super pigmented and they were easy to work with you get 15 shadows the palette is 20 dollars, and you can only get it through the ColourPop website as of now and the back has the names of all the eyeshadows so it makes it easy for you guys um, to know like if you guys do see a tutorial like I'm going to show you guys how I got this look You'll know exactly what colors I'm using if you guys wanted to recreate that look So these are the shades right here all the swatches of the palette and like I said, these are super pigmented and Super easy to work with the colors are beautiful And also I got two of the highlights or I think they only had two highlights so I got both of them this one is taffy and this one is a right off the bat it looks like a peachy highlight but it transfers nicely on the skin with a gold reflex if you guys can see that's what I'm wearing right now on my skin so this one's really pretty and then the next one that I got this one is in the color touche and this one is more of like a yellow highlight with a kind of like a lilac undertone shimmer if that makes sense so those are the two highlights that I ended up getting and then I only got two lipsticks or lip glosses this one is the one I'm wearing right now this one is in the color lazy and then this one is in the color imagine and this is a red lip gloss with a lot of glitter this one is really pretty I'm gonna show you guys swatches also here are the shades of the highlighters Starting from the left is Touche, which is the one that looks more uh, yellow with that lilac undertone. The one next to it is Taffy, and that is the peachy highlight. The next one, that is the lip gloss. That's the red one in Imagine. And the next one is in Lazy. So let's get started with the tutorial. My eyes have already been primed and set, so we're ready to go. And to start off with, I'm gonna go ahead and take this shade right here, Top Notch, and I'm gonna use that as my transition shade. So when you dip your brush in here, like I just did, it does kick up some powder, um, but we'll see how that blends into the eye, because sometimes kick up isn't a horrible thing. Next step, I'm gonna use this shade right here, and this is Teacup. It's blending out really nice. I'm not having a hard time blending it out. I'm gonna take a clean brush and just blend this out. I'm gonna go ahead and take this color right here and this is the color in Wishful Thinking. It's a nice olivey color with a nice shimmer. And I'm gonna use, I'm gonna see how it works with a brush first and if I don't like it, which I almost end up never liking it with the brush, when it comes to shimmers and then I'm gonna if not I'll use my finger it's not bad but I think I could get more of a payoff with my finger and I was right. Yeah, I feel like a lot of shimmers and and uh, metallics, you just have to put it, put them on with your finger 
to get a nice payoff. I thought it was green, but it's like a burnt gold. And then I'm actually gonna use, um, I'm gonna go back in with the brush and with that same color, I'm gonna just do some detail work up here just to kind of clean it up. And that way I could extend it past the crease. Perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and use my clean brush and just blend this out. I go ahead and take this color right here. This is the color Big Spoon, and uh, I'm gonna take a let's take this brush right here and dip it in that color. And that color, I'm just gonna place it up here. These colors are really pigmented. I'm not dipping my brush too much. And the color payoff with these mattes is amazing. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and clean up that top brow bone area with this color right here and this is Now and Zen. Okay, and I'm just gonna place this up here just to clean that area up and to highlight the brow bone. There you go. Now let's deepen out the outer corner. I'm gonna take this um, color right here and this is in the shade Pitter Patter. I'm gonna use this flat shader brush and dip it in that color and just deepen out that outer corner um, out here. Okay, even this color is really nice. That is true to color. I'm loving this palette. I'm going back with that blending brush without adding any more product and just blend that out. Bring back into that shade and then bringing it in a little bit more into the eye. Start at the corner, smoke that out a little. And then take that clean brush This color I notice is really pigmented so it's a little bit harder to work with but it's doable so when you t dip into the um, shadow just make sure you don't get a lot of product in there because when you blend it out I feel like it just went everywhere but you could still see that color so it doesn't look muddy or anything it's just really pigmented so you got to be careful and I'm gonna go ahead and take this color right here this is me trying every single color almost. This one's called Never Never. And I'm gonna go ahead and use my finger and then get this color closer into the eye, corner of the eye. Oh my God. I love it. Mm -hmm. Look at how, oh my God. How pigmented that is. I'm gonna take this color right here. This is Treat Yourself. And that's my inner corner highlight. So I'm gonna do that and put it in here. It's just a little bit brighter. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Oh! <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and line my eyes with the L'Oreal lacquer liner and I'm gonna use this um, angled brush. Eyeliner is done, so now I'm gonna go ahead and do mascara. I 
this is the completed eye look. I'm not gonna put anything under my um, on my lash line, on my bottom lash line, just because I like how open it looks right now. And now I'm gonna go ahead and bronze, and then I'll do the uh, blush, and then I'll show you guys how the highlighters look, and then we'll put something under it. Right, so now I'm gonna use the highlighter. So I'm gonna highlight with this one right here. This is Taffy. And I'm gonna use this brush right here. That's pretty. I thought I was gonna show up like orangey or yellow, like orangey on my skin, but it has like a nice gold undertone. So that's really pretty. So out of the lip glosses, I'm gonna use this one. This one is in the shade Lazy. And just so that the red one doesn't overpower the look. Oh, this is so pretty. And this is a completed look using this whole collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this um, review slash tutorial and let me know if you guys are gonna pick it up what are you guys gonna pick up besides the palette and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video bye